Welcome to another episode of Timmy Talks in Chandelar. And for the next hour or so, I'm going to dive back into Chandelar again. This is already episode 22, which is kind of crazy, right? 22 hours in this campaign. Yeah. Mm. So I've been doing some thinking. So I've got five of those white gems, which is pretty good, right? So I think the next thing I've got to do, so I was looking at the map, is, you know, try to get to these... Um, villages around the white towns because they apparently still have a mana link to give away so i want to get those mana links and i also want to collect ivory towers because i've been thinking my deck so if you look at my deck so here we have my deck one right if you look at my deck it is really good it is four time walks that's insane you know ancestral recall all the um contract from below which is kind of insane the problem is there's no life gain in here Right. So if I don't have any life gain, <laughs> it, it's not going to work, you know, against the end boss. So I think what I'm going to do, I'm firstly, I've made a new deck. So I'm going to play with this deck today. This is uh, a Tron deck. Uh, I, I thought it's more fun to play with this um, because the, the blue black deck is just so good. So I thought maybe it would be cool to just try out a new a new brew. Um, and also I've been thinking about I want to collect those ivory towers, have more life gain against the end boss. So in today's episode, I'm gonna go for mana links and I'm gonna go for uh, ivory towers, okay? Um, this deck, by the way, so this is a Tron deck and I thought Tron works really well with Contract From Below because of Contract From Below, I can draw a lot so I can draw into natural Tron more often. And also with Contract From Below, I can discard like big creatures that I don't have that much yet though, like Colossus of Sardia, so I wanna get more Colossuses as well and then play animate debt on that. You know, cause somebody rightfully said in the comments, if you're playing with so many contracts from below, you need to also play with graveyard recursion. So I was like, okay, you got a good point. So I'm doing that today. Anyway, uh, enough talk. Let's check the map. Okay, so we're gonna find some mana links. They're all white towns here. So you should be able to get some mana links. Let's, let's go. Okay, what's up with you, Pegasus? Accept tributes. Two red duels. Jewels. Jewels for sure. Duels will be nice too, but. Let's go for the jewels. Trade black amulets for any enchantments. Hmm, diabolic machine. Could be nice in the artifact deck. Okay, so we have a juggernaut, a sea dragon. We can win a leviathan, that is funny. Okay, duel the sea dragon. Start the duel. Um, what do I have? Colossus, Dance at Scimitar, Earth's Powerplan, Mishra's Factory, Force Field, the Hive, and a Diabolic Machine. Wow, this, this is a bad M. Maybe my Tron deck is not as good as I thought it was. Um, Let's see what to do here. A swamp. Okay, I'm just gonna go for power plant and hopefully just draw into Tron. Maybe a miracle happens. I'm just gonna draw mine and tower next. Okay, just to paralyze though. Okay, let's go then for factory and see if I can attack next turn. I mean, I've got swamp and paralyze, so I can take out the first creature that, that uh, he plays. Okay, another factory. That's not too shabby. Let's do that. We're just going to go uh, full aggressive here. Change to assembly worker. And then we're going to pump the assembly worker. Let's attack! I mean, this works, right? A mox jet. Okay, that's nice. Sure. Let's do swamp as well. Oh, I can cast dancing scimitar. Mm -hmm. Cast a hive. That is tempting. Play the hive and start making tokens. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Let's play the hive and start making one-on-one -on -one wasps. A sea serpent, okay, so. That is a little bit scary, but you know what? I'm just not gonna do anything. I'm just I'm just gonna assume that he's not gonna play Phantasmal Terrain, which obviously is in his deck, but maybe he doesn't have it. 
Ooh, a water elemental. Hmm. Let's make a hive token. Another swamp, which is good because that means I can play a paralyzed only water elemental. Shall I attack? That's the I mean, I'm not going to jump. Then again, if he plays Phantasmal Terrain, he can hit me for 10, but I can make a token. Yeah, I'm going to attack. I'm just going to go deep into my hive strategy. So he's going to attack. You know what? I'm going to take the damage. I'm pretty high anyway. Ooh, Demonic Tutor. Okay, so what would I tutor for? That's the question. I think I'm going to first play a Force Field. So I can do Force Field and have a tutor and have mana open to use the Force Field. Right? I think so. Yeah, I do. Okay, so now we're going to play the tutor. Contract from below, perhaps, is the best option. Right, I could go contract. I think it's because I only have creatures in hand. It's actually really good to play contract here. Um, I'm only gonna attack with one because I think I'm gonna jump in this case. Oh, look at that! A jump on the sea serpent. Oh, oh, dude. Oh man, I get so much respect here for this uh, computer. You can kill the wasp with this play. I mean. If you win the game, I think that would be fair after this this very, very solid play. I mean, that's very impressive. Okay, we're just going to let it through. And now we're going to use Force Field. There we go. And now we only take one damage. Like Force Field is a really nice card. So prevent all but one comma damage from any one source. Ooh, a weakness. It is tempting to also play the weakness here. Um, okay, we'll play weakness on water elemental. Then we'll play contract. Okay, we got an anime dead. That's what we want. So let's do anime dead. Let's get the Colossus, the deck's working. Yay, <laughs> that is sweet. I mean, it's not, oh, again, a jump on the Sea Serpent, what? Oh, this dude is killing me. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. Okay, man, you kill it, it's fine. Um, I'm just gonna pass. Okay, so now I can attack with my 8-9, and he actually cannot kill it. That is funny. Even if he does, though, I mean, I can just get it back. I've got enough animates. Mm, Triskelion. Let's play out the trike. Let's go for the trike. The cool thing with trike here is I can put... Oh, I can actually kill him already. Oh, man, I wanted to do so much more. Take the cards. Oh yeah. Found this. Oh no. Is he attacking something? Black amulet. I'm afraid though that I gotta go protect, but let's first find some extra goodies. You happen upon a Ooh, thieves take half your gold. What? I got a lot of gold. Oh, that's really bad. Clockwork avian. Ooh, I should put that in my deck. I mean, that's a nice thing that I have a new deck now that you've got like cards that you want to put in. Uh, Clockwork avian. Let's put it in. What to take out? Um, I think a Juggernaut, because it's the deck's more controlling anyway. I think Juggernaut doesn't really fit the bill. Mana Vault I could take out, actually. Mana Vault is not that great in this format, I feel, in this, this way of playing Magic. Um, Blight is pretty nasty. Howl from Beyond, I could get a second copy. Or a third card. Let's do that. I mean, I've got plenty of them. Um, 
buy some food. Attacking Aleron Haven. Where's Aleron Haven? That's all the way over there. Yeah, I have to take. Uh, I have to use a gem. Duel the Netherfiend. I'm uh, I'm really curious if I can win it. To be honest, because I'm playing with this Tron deck, which is you know, it's good, but it doesn't have four time walks, right? Um. Yeah, let's go Urza's Tower, Urza's Mine. I've got Contract from below in hand, so I can probably then Contract into... Ooh, Nether Shadow. Yeah, that can attack the turn it comes into play. That's pretty neat. Uh, but what I wanted to say, I can probably use Contract from below to find the Power Plant. This is a pretty decent hand. Is it a great hand? No, but it's, it's decent. Yeah, man, attack me again, it's fine. I think I'm going to play a weakness on it, to be honest. Ooh, flying creature. Oh, man, so many options. The thing is, I can only do one thing, right? That's the problem. I could play Demonic to find... I should probably do that. Play Demonic to find a... Um... Uh, to find a power plant. Let's do that. Power plant. Pastor. I mean, this is what you want to do in life, right? Play play old school Tron in Chandelar. That's just funny. Okay, take me for four. Bring it on. Pump it. Sure. There we go. Urza's power plant. So I can make eight mana. I can cast two Dancing Scimitars or I could go Clockwork Avian and Weakness. That's probably better. Let's go Tower, Mine. Let's play Weakness. Because you kind of want to empty your hand now as quickly as you can, right? So I'm going to go Weakness on the end. Wow, look at him go, like he's super aggressive. Does it mean he's got like Howl from Beyond or something? No, he's just attacking. Um, Dancing Scimitar, Dancing Scimitar. Ooh, now I've got a mana left. Stupid, I should have tapped it myself. <laughs> and I'm gonna take Mana Burn. <sighs> Which is completely unnecessary. Of course, get your Bakken back with Anime Dead, so you've got an 0-1 Flyer. Ooh, Nether... That's actually kind of scary, this Nether... Sorry, Frozen Shade, I mean. Um, I'm gonna Paralyze the Shade. That's how we roll. There's nothing here, there's nothing here. I think I'm gonna play Contract. Let's go Mox. Ooh, I could go Juggernaut, but the Hive is probably better. I'm gonna go Hive, because I can start making tokens. Um, oh, I can still play cards here. Juggernaut or Guardian Beast. You know what, I'm gonna go Juggernaut, because then I, I can just attack, I don't have to think. Uh, let's attack with the Clockwork Avian, because I've got enough blockers now. I love Paralyze on Frozen Shade, right? Because if he invests four mana to untap it, he doesn't have mana left to pump it. So it's it's pretty effective. Oh, Colossus of Sardia. I really want to have more Colossus of Sardia. Um, but let's first attack, though. I got to attack with the Juggernaut. Um, let's also attack with the Avian. Why not? Five points left. Okay, one, two, three. Three and one and two. Um, what to cast next? Let's go for Colossus. Oh, again! Look at that! I need to tap myself because again, I'm taking a damage. Although I could go and cast Guardian Beast, and then I no longer have to take any damage. Okay, so that's better. I'm liking this deck. I have to say, I'm enjoying playing this. 
And this is a deck you can only play on Shambhalar because Contract from Below um, is such an important card in this Tron deck, right? And you cannot play Contract um, in real life tournaments. So it's nice. Um, let's see. What should I do? Another Frozen Shade. He's got really small creatures, so... I think I can just play a Factory and attack with my Colossus. Let's attack with my Avian, because I think I'm going to put counters on my Avian next turn. Okay, so he's on five. I'm just going to pass. I can make a 1-1 Flyer at the end of turn with the Hive. Um, okay, okay, he's attacking, okay. Um, I'm going to make a token. And I'm gonna block, so I'm gonna block this dude. I mean, he's probably gonna kill the uh, scimitar, but that's fine. Okay, so he's on five. Oh, I should have. Oh, I should have put the counters on Avian. <sighs> Stupid. And I should have untap my colossus i am really am i going to give my opponent another turn because i'm just too stupid for this game i am i am um he's got two attackers i've got a factory i don't think i can make it mm, i am going to attack with the beast because i think he's kind of forced to well i mean he can just take two damage exactly he's not he's not forced to do anything at all um Ooh, I could get the Frozen Shade, because I can pump the Shade. Nah, I'm not going to do it. Never mind. I'm so bad at this game. Unbelievable. Again, forgetting to make the Hive Token end step. Anyway, uh, and let's put counters on this. Okay, done. Yay, I remembered everything in my own turn. That's something. Let's play a Swamp. Um, I can play a Weakness. You know what? I'm first just going to attack. Let's see. Let's see what's going to happen. Oh, wow. Nine points left. One, two, three. One, two, three. Three and one, two, three. Why not? Hey, I've won already. Okay, that's good. Race dead, dark ritual sacrifice. Strip mine is good. I can play with more strips. But I want to take the dungeon clue. North of Blood Sand Tower. That's all the way at the bottom. I can get a time vault. That would be pretty cool. Time vault twiddle. I got first move. Yeah. Okay, so I've saved these dudes. Where am I? Oh yeah, Eleron Haven. So here's Croc Bazaar. So I think... Let's free Celestial Shrine. Why not? And then while we're at it, I'm going to try to get some Mana Link missions going. Trade green amulets for any fast effects. Do I want fast effects? No. Begin a quest. Ooh, we reward you with a mana link. Yes, please. Aleron Haven. Where is that? Go east. Okay, so east. Oh, it's over there. I just came from there. Okay, sure. Wrath of God. I think I'm going to buy the wrath. Gloom. No, I don't need the gloom. Okay. Mm. Let's go back again, people. And then we'll go to that shipwreck that we saw. Hey! Okay, guys, gonna go again. That was really an easy mana link. That's the kind of mana links you want to earn. There was a shipwreck here earlier.
create blue amulets for any fast effect. Vampire Lord attacking Andor Spire. Where's Andor Spire? Of course, all the way up there. Why not? If you combine Angry Mob with Magical Hack, you can change the mob to grow larger when your opponent have lands other than swamps. Okay, that is... <laughs> that is funny. That is cool, my man. Um... Man, those vampire lords are annoying. I have to go there. Duel the vampire lord. Start the duel. What do I have? Power, power play mine tower, ideal. Okay, I mean, I don't have any big artifacts to play, but who cares? I can have Tron in three turns. Yeah. Let's do it, yeah. I actually play Tron at a lot of tournaments, old school tournaments. Um, the best I ever got was like a top eight, but it's really tough. Usually you end up like a three, two, two or a two, three result. But it was fun, that's important. Uh, let's have a look, sorry, what's he doing? Mana Vault. Oh no, Sengir. That is not good. Um, I gotta play Swamp Paralyze. I got to. I mean, I so want to play out. Well, I could have done Force Field, actually. I could have done Tower Force Field. But then I take Mana Burn as well. Wow, that's kind of tough, actually. Ooh, another Mana Vault. I wonder if he's going to use a Mana Vault to untap the Sengir. That would be funny. Carrion Ants. Ooh, that is risky. Luckily for me... I've got a weakness. That is a great answer to the Carrion Ants. Let's play the Force Field. Ooh, and I could animate Death the Carrion Ants. That is Carrion Ants with Tron. That is really cool. I can, ooh, next turn. <laughs> animate Dead, baby. I'm really enjoying this new deck. Of course, Howling Mine, sure, man, help me out. That's no problem. Um, let's go Swamp. Um. Hmm. I'm gonna go Swamp Swamp to play Animate Dead. I'm gonna get the Carrying Nets. And that's it. I mean, now I have Tron, but I don't have the right artifacts. That's a bit of a bummer. I really need to get more, um... Oh no, no, dude, dude, dude. Uh, annoying. I'm just gonna do it twice. So you can use force field as a mana sink. That's pretty good to know. Mm, I am afraid that I will have to Play my contract and throw away a lot of these sweet lands and another contract. But look at what I'm getting back. Wow. Okay. So I can go Diabolic Machine. Diabolic Machine is seven. Um, Guardian Beast, Dance, Scimitar, Demonic Tutor, Anime, Dead, Guardian Beast, Mistress Factory, Diabolic. Okay. Let's go for Diabolic Machine. Um, and then I could play out Guardian Beast. But then I could also just do Dancing Scimitar. No, yeah, I can do Dancing Scimitar. Let's do that. Pass the turn. Because Dancing Scimitar can block the, uh, the Vampire. Ooh, that, those weaknesses are good, man. Those weaknesses hit home. Um, let's see, factory. I can play Juggernaut. Guardian Beast, why not? It's too bad they don't have Chaos Orb in this game. That would be really fun. Um, uh, let's do Juggernaut, Power Plant, and the Mine. That's it. I can't really, I don't really have a good attack. Right? I mean, it can attack with the Scimitar. It's just going to block. 
Demo what should I look up with the demonic? Uh, Coloss of Sardia, maybe? Another howling mine. Wow, that's awesome. He's really helping me. Um, let's just attack with the juggernaut and see what he does. Ooh, this is good news. Um, let's do the hive first. So tower and a mine. Let's play the hive. Let's play a scimitar. Um, mine and power plant. Shall I be really mean and just animate that his... Yeah, why not? I'm going to be mean. Going to animate that his own singular vampire. Or should I have done... I, I, should, I should have done the carrying ants because it's more fun. Anyway, I've done it already. Uh, demonic tutor in hand still. So I could demonic tutor for... Probably should do that. Even though I'm going to get mana burn. Um, do I, yeah, contract from below. Two damage from mana burn, wow. Probably could have done that better somehow, but whatever. Whatever, man. Anime dead. Ooh, he's got my juggernaut. But I'm going to play contract from below. I'm going to draw into something good, I feel like. Ooh, another mine. That is nice. What? I clicked too quickly. Oh, me, me and Chandelar. It's, oh, I love the game so much, but I make so many mistakes. It's ridiculous. Um, let's attack with the flying army. Why not? Let's do it. Okay, let's play a land first. Um, let's play a mine second. I mean, who doesn't like more cards, right? Let's play a mine. Sorry, a gem they tell I mean. Let's play Paralyze on this dude. And we can even play out another mine. <laughs> that would be fun. Let's do it. Then we have five Howling Mines in the game. That is ridiculous. Uh, I even have enough mana to draw something. I also want to make a Hive token. I feel like I haven't done that uh, at all. So Hive is five mana, right? So I can make six. No, I don't have enough to end draw a card and make a Hive token. You know what? I'm going to pass. I'm going to pass it to you. Let's double block. I'm going to draw five cards next turn, right? No, six even, I think. Whoa, carry Nance to the party. I got to use the hive here. Make a token. Oh, Colossal Sardia, but I also have a try. I'm just going to play the Triton. Let's see, do I need these cards? Nope. Let's take the dungeon clue. South of Cold Snap Tower. I can wait, I can get a balance, which is not too shabby. I like Fork, such a cool card. Mm. So again, my magic bag is full. What does this skull here mean? Oh, minus three lives. That's why I have the skull. Oh man. Okay. Um so I guess I gotta sell stuff again, right? Bom, 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 bom. Let me 
do we need forests? Am I actually, let's check it out. No, I don't need forests, so I can sell the forests. Get out of here, forests. Do I need tropical islands if I'm not gonna, I know, I know I'm selling them cheap, but I'm just thinking about, I wanna make space and I don't wanna spend too much time. Sell them all. Let's see. You know what? I'm 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 kind of fine. Are there any artifacts I can sell? You know, I'm not going to use this. It's a cool. I'm not going to use. They're cool cards, but I'm not going to play with them. For now, at least. Da 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 da. I mean, selling cards is always difficult. Even even if it's a digital world, I just don't like it. I don't like to do it. I mean, Bog Imp. I'm not going to play a Bog Imp. Dun, 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 dun. Dark Rituals, Mummy. I'm not going to play the Mummy. What else do I have that I can sell? I mean, I'm not gonna play the race dads, I think. We can go. Anyway, enough, enough. Selling, I don't like selling cards. Um, okay, let's have a look. Where are we? We're here. So Celestial, Celestine Spire should have some mana link missions. So let's go check it out, people. See if we can find some missions for mana links. Begin a quest. Two black amulets, the necromancer. No, because I want to have mana links. Begin a quest. Defeat the vamp. You know I'm gonna accept because I saw the vampire lord like just outside. There he is. Yes. No, I want to fight against you. Exactly. For a moment there, I thought I couldn't fight against him. Okay, play first. What do we have? Diabolic Machine, Power Plant, Howling Mine, uh, Swamp, Scimitar, Paralyzed, Diabolic Machine. Okay. Uh, it's a pretty bad hand. I'm not, I'm not going to sure code it. The good thing is I've got a Howling Mine. So turn two, I can go Howling Mine, hopefully draw into the Tron lands I need. That's the thing with this Tron strategy, right? You need to have Tron to like get the deck to work properly. That's also why I'm playing Paralyze and Weakness, because they're just really easy and cheap to cast, and then I can also cast them without a, without having Tron. Um, okay, so I'm going to go Swamp, and that's it. i got a pass turn. Problem here is, obviously, I'm giving my opponent an extra card as well. So that's, that's a little dangerous. But hey, we'll see. Okay, carrying ants, it's not great, but I've got the Paralyze. Ooh, and now I even have something better, weakness. I am really starting to like the weakness. The weakness is again a card that I never play in, in regular old school, but I've been thinking about it. Ooh, anime deading it again. Let's go, Mox Jet. Hmm, no, not the right Tron Lance. I need an Urtz's Mind still. I'm gonna go Paralyze. And I'm gonna go Dancing Scimitar. Because now he untaps, but he only has one mana remaining, so I can just block the Carrying Ants with the Scimitar. Ooh, a Bats. Discarding Uncle Istvan, man, that's not cool. Hey, look at this. It's 
So now the party can get started. First, another one on here. Um, wow, I've got a trike I can cast. Can I play Diabolic? Really? I don't understand why I cannot play out the Diabolic Machine. Let's see, let's see what happens. Oh, okay. Okay. I thought I had more mana open, but I probably just made a mistake. Ooh, wow, getting back everything here. Okay, Ertz's tower, and now I can play out the, uh, oh, I don't have Colossus of Sardia? Yeah, I do. I don't have enough mana for Colossus? But I do. I think the computer is a bit confused, or I'm, I'm, I'm missing something, because I've got tower, power plant. Oh, I don't have Tron yet. I thought I had Tron. I don't have Tron. Ooh, that explains. That ex I was already looking at it. And I'm like, huh? Why can I not play it out? But I just don't have. Don't have what I need, man. Okay. Um, in that case, I'm going to cast another Howling Mine. And a Scimitar. I'm not going to play Contract from below because I have so many good cards I want to play out first. What can you use black amulets for anyway? Like I know the white amulets are for the for traveling, right? But what can you do with the black ones? Wow, so many cards, so many cards. Still no Tron though. Weakness. Oh, he's gonna try to <laughs> he's gonna try to make the uh, carrying ant survive by pumping it up. That's cute. That is cute, my man. It's not very smart or effective, but it's cute. I get it. And then it's going to die now. Select a card to discard. Ooh. Um, I'm going to discard the Juggernaut. Maybe I should have done the power plant, by the way. So many carrying ants, and they are kind of dangerous because he can he can pump them up big time. Uh, okay, Ertz is mine. That's good. Oh, I've got eleven cards in hand. So now I need to scroll through my own hand or something. How does that work? Anyway, let's play force field first. And then we're gonna play Colossus. Um, Gemtone? Question mark. Okay, and then I can play Paralyze. On one of the carrying ants. Am I still gonna attack? I think I am. Why not? Why not? Let's just attack. He's drawing also, of course, a ton of cards, but that was really weird, right? That hand with 11 cards where I couldn't see the cards that I had at the top. Probably, now that I'm looking at these arrows, look, there's arrows here that I can use, of course. I'm so stupid. Um, Sengir Vampire, okay. Let's just first draw. You know, this this game is getting really complicated with so many cards. I'm just going to swing in with my Colossus of Sardian and see, just see what's going to happen. Oh, wow. Um, one, two, three, four, right? One. I mean, Uncle Isfan's not going to take the damage anyway, so. 
Hey, I'm gonna win through trample damage, that's good. Uh, let's take the dungeon clue. I already knew all that. You're a mighty sorcerer, what am I getting? That's unclear, but I'm getting black mana stones, that's good. Uh, let's have a look, where am I at? So I'm here. Maybe this village will give me something? What is the vampire lord attacking now? Begin a quest. Reward you with the mana link. The keeper of Sarmal Haven. Where is that? Oh, that's all. You know what? I'll do that. And after that, I'll free the village. Is that stupid or is that smart? I don't know. Accept tribute for your mercy. Three red jewels. Hey, there we go. Trade blue amulets for fast effects. No, thank you. Oh, Leviathan, that's so cool. Segovian Leviathan. Um, let's go and free them. Duel the Vampire Lord. I'm fighting a lot of these lords. And by the way, I haven't been able to find a single ivory tower, which was part of my mission. Mana link wise, we're doing fine, but uh, ivory tower wise, we're horrible, horrible condition. Um, let's see, Anime Dead, Demonic Tutor, Trike, Dancing Scimitar, Mox Jet, Urza's Powerplant, Urza's Tower. Ooh, I can do a turn one. Demonic Tutor. You know what I'm going to tutor for? Because I'm a cool cat. I'm going to tutor for a mine, Urza's Mine. Because then I have Tron. And I know, I know, I know, you can go for Contract from below, draw a whole new hand, but I mean, I want to have Tron. Let's go power plant, pass the turn. Mm -hmm. The computer is thinking. Ooh, carrying, a lot of carrying ants, but I'm, I'm just fighting vampire lords all the time, right? Um, so now I can play mine. Then I can play trike. We got to do that very smart so I don't take any damage, no mana burn. And I'm going to kill the carrying ants on site. Ooh, and I can animate dead. I can get the carrying ants next turn. Ooh, that'll be fun. That'll be cool. Probably he has an animate dead, but if he doesn't... Um, you know what? I don't mind if it's in um, my graveyard here soon. I don't go. I don't mind. Carrion ants. Let's see. So I could go. Let's tap the tower, tap the power plant, play scimitar. Now we're going to play animate. From my opponent's. Oh, well, I can do from my graveyard. I'm just going to get the trike back. And let's kill the carrion ants again. It's like we're walking in circles, but it's fine. It's a circle I like because I'm winning, so. And I've got 21 life, right? That's really sweet. So the mana link strategy is kind of working. Uh, Sorcerer's Queen, sure, I can kill the queen as well. That's that's no problem. No problem. Um, there is a problem now in the sense that I just don't have anything in my hand anymore. I'm out of gas. If I can get like more trikes, more Colossus of Sardias, Ivory Towers, I think this deck could be really good. Maybe the Abyss, which I don't know if it's in this game. Probably not, but if it is, it would be cool. Mm. Let's attack. <clears throat> okay, Factory is good because I can put some pressure on next turn. Let's go, go, go. Put him on six. The question is, where can I find the artifacts I need for this deck? It's kind of hard to get artifacts. Uh, Sengir hitting the board. 
Is that a problem? It's a minor problem. Let's play a weakness. Let's cast a Juggernaut. Let's pass the turn. Hey, a Howling Mine, that's cool. Diabolic Machine, I like Diabolic Machine. I think it's fun. Diabolic Machine. Earth's Tower, Earth's Power Plant, Earth's Power Plant. I mean, it's ridiculously expensive, Diabolic Machine, but I like the art with the two eyes here and that the soldier is getting crunched. And I mean, it is a regenerator. Is it how much to regenerate? Three, yeah, that's pretty steep, but. You know, it was in the dark. Play Guardian Beast. Guardian Beast, which is actually not that great in this deck. I don't really have, like if I would play with Nevenerald Disc, it could kind of work. Because the disc then comes back in play. Of course, it does destroy the Guardian Beast, but it's kind of nice. And, and all your artifacts are not destroyed. There's the Queen. Okay, um, I think I can win it, right? Let's attack with, you know, Trike, you can also attack, just because it's funny, why not? Hey, do I want these cards? They're really cool cards, but I'm gonna take the dungeon. Oh, Black Lotus, Black Lotus! You gotta get the Lotus, south of Cold Snap Mill. Ooh, okay, wait a minute, wait a minute. Where are we at? Here's Gold Snap Mill. This is white, but you know what we're gonna do? I'm first gonna see if I can get some more mana links, but I'm just gonna go towards Gold Snap Mill. South of Gold Snap Mill. Sweet. Oh, there it is! There's the, there it is! Okay, but before I go in, I need to kind of prepare myself here. Um, green Amulet. South to my brother, I keep a Unicorn Oasis, where's that? South is down, right? Unicorns. Oh, that's all the way over there. Hmm. For a green amulet? No. Let's let's have a look at that dungeon of cross keep. Life loss carried over. Power struggle in effect. Okay, so if power struggle is in effect, I need to play with the white deck. Um don't like, I, I, I'm just not a big fan. Oh, and if I play with the white deck, I gotta adjust it, because it's blue, right? Um, Northern Paladin out. Thunder Spirit, sorry, Angel Archaeology, Spirit Wing, Smote. Karma can go out. CLP Black can go out. Do I have a COP blue? I do, okay, so I could play that. I mean, I gotta play Disenchants, right? You wanna get rid of that card ASAP. So play Disenchants. I could go Holy Light, because it's got small white creatures, right? So I could play Holy Light. Um, Already has four Sarah Angels. Let's see what artifacts I have still. I definitely need to put in Triskelion. I mean, that that card's bonkers against that. Uh, and maybe Onulets for some life gain. Why not? Ooh, Rod of Ruin. They're smaller creatures. Um, trike. Let's take the Onulet back out again. Uh, how many creatures do I have? Two, six, eight, nine, because I can get that one back. I don't have a lot of creatures though. Maybe I need to take the Crusades out, because I don't have, oh yeah, I've got four scimitars, so that helps. It's 13, 14. Hmm. Would you play with Ornithopters to kind of stop the first wave of attackers? I mean, it does block the one ones. 
You know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to play only that. Because only that is going to give me life. I'm very tempted to save right now, <laughs> you know, because I really want that black loads, but I'm not going to do it. I mean, I got I got to feel it here, right? That I'm taking on the challenge. Um, I think I'm going to do it. You know what? Let's go. Let's go for it. Let's go for it, people. Why not? Oh, power struggle in effect. Got to make a little screenshot here for the for the show. We got to do it for the show. Oh man, power struggle in effect. Okay. I do feel prepared that I checked out the hints and everything. I think it's very professional of me. So feel free to leave compliments about my that my play keeps getting better. You know my knowledge of Chandelier. I'm open to compliments. Uh, okay, a question. Which of these spells has trample? Obsidian's Golem, Phantasmal Forces, Goblin Rock Sled, Thunderables, or the Artillery? That's the Rock Sled, people. That is the Rock Sled. Another question. What is the power rating of Sephir Falcon? That's a 1-1 one -one flyer. Ooh, and we got a lot of dice. Let's start with this dice. Osai Vultures. I like that. La la la, there we go, there we go. Ooh. Oh, the treasure is there. Is that the Black Lotus? Could it be the Black Lotus? Ooh, another question, okay. What is the toughness of Pikeman? That's the one. Ooh, this is trick. I think I wanna dual her. Because then I have this axis and I can go there. Let's go. Power struggle is in effect. I know. I'm going to play first. Oh, power struggle has a very annoying sound. Uh, let's see. Planes, modes, swords, only let rot, thunder spirit, trike. So it's really light on mana, right? Uh, but at least I got a swords to plowshares, which, which I'm happy about. Hopefully I'm gonna draw into a disenchant because power struggle is just too annoying to play against. Ooh. Oh, I gotta click on the power struggle. Okay, I'll click on the power struggle. This game is sometimes so annoying. Let's attack. Okay. I mean, this is so annoying, right? I'm losing my I, I'm losing my planes for an island. I cannot cast anything next turn. Unless, of course, I draw into a planes, which would be sweet. Of course I don't. Uh, let's attack here. What to discard? Um, it doesn't really matter that much, does it? I think I'm gonna go for Rod of Ruin. I just want my planes back, man. I mean, this power struggle card is so annoying. <sighs> I mean, look look at my computer. It needs so much time to think. Oh no, Timmy, that is really good. Oh, I was hoping that I could get that Timmy. That Timmy's gonna kill my, my vulture. Um, what to discard here? I'm gonna discard a moat because I've got the moats anyway. Oh, this is so... I want my planes back! Give me back my planes, please! Sure, kill it. Do it. Oh, the first game in. Okay, those are planes. Done, done.
I mean, the computer needs so much time. I'm I'm afraid it's gonna. Oh, another Tim! Oh no! Um, let's play swords on the existing Tim. Okay, at least I can now play COPD. Oh, this is so annoying, but it's good that I've tapped out all my lands, because now probably he's going to get a tap land back. Oh, I mean... Yeah, of course, Animate Artifact. That's actually a pretty cool move. I like it. I like it. Okay, so I can play Planes. I could go for Onulet, or I could go for Thunder Spirit. Um... Gotta go for Onulet, because if he steals my Onulet. Oh, he was waiting for me to tap out so he could deal with damage. Very clever, very clever. No! Unsummon! He's, his deck is so good with the power struggle. Oh, no. No, don't do that. Oh, God. Here you go, moats, people, a moat. Now you can no longer attack. Yeah, eat that for breakfast. Oh man, this is... I just wanna, wanna get a disenchant, kill the power struggle and move on with my life. Oh man, a pirate ship, yeah, of course. Wait, I have mana for COP blue, really? Oh, damn it. Oh man. Um, I mean, I can cast the thing. No, I'm not going to do it. I'm just going to pass. I got to be patient, I feel. I mean, at least I can prevent the damage with COP Blue, you know, and, and Power Struggle doesn't take into uh, enchantments into, into its ability. So I have the moat in COP Blue, so that should be enough, actually. I need to, need to wait until I draw into a disenchant. I mean, another option could be play the trike, kill the... My own Onulet and my Tim, perhaps, for some life. And then, yeah, that could be another option. But I have to wait. So why is it not taking this? This is so annoying. So I go COP Blue. Pay one. Click. Oh. <sighs> I mean, we're in here for a long game. I mean, this dungeon could take a long time, but I need to to put the hours in, man, to get that Black Lotus Apprentice Wizard. I mean, it, it is a cool deck. I mean, I do like it. I just don't like the power struggle. Again, I gotta click on struggle. Oh, I wish I could just get an untapped mana to play that trike, or or even better, draw into a disenchant. I'm playing four disenchants. Oh, this game is so frustrating. Can we can we just stop? What I can see happening here is that the game is just going to crash.
Oh wow, he's gonna kill me with Rod of Ruin? Oh god. Okay, planes, finally. Uh, let's play Trike. Kill. And then next turn, you can have my Triskelion and my Tap Mana. Hey! Oh, of course, he got life because he is the oh, controller of the Onulet. Stupid. I wasn't even thinking about that. I just gave him life. Oh, God. Holy light, okay, that's something. I'm gonna wait with holy light, because he's probably gonna cast some more. Mm, man, this is tough. Man, oh man. Um, Then again, you know, if I if I can trade into something, hmm, I'm gonna pass. Am I gonna get slowly killed by the Rod of Ruin? That's the question now. I feel like I have to be patient, to be honest. I mean, I know I'm on 12, which is not great because I started on 21 and I still have a whole dungeon to go through. But if I start playing out flyers and he's going to get the flyers himself to attack me with, with them, I mean, that's really bad, right? I don't want to, I don't want to get into that scenario. Um, so I just got to pass. If you can just find a disenchant, you know, one disenchant. course another one why not <sighs> oh side vultures where is where is how many cards do i have in my deck still is there a way to see that count library cards 39 there are four disenchants in those 39 remaining can we please give me a disenchant It's also, it's also tiring, you know? See you people, and you gotta click, 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 just to prevent the damage. Yes, I know. I know I'm whining a lot, but I mean, can you blame me with this board state and that p stupid power struggle? And I mean, I'm getting killed by a Rod of Ruin, which is actually kind of cool, but I really want to get the Black Lotus. Oh. Oh, he's got two Rod of Runes. That's why it's going so fast. You know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to play them out. 
Whatever. I ran out of patience. Make fun of me in the comments, but I ran out of patience. I'm slowly dying to those Rod of Ruins, so I feel like I have to do this. This is actually not too bad. I think. I don't know. No! 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 Oh, God. Did he just steal my dancing scimitar? Oh, God. Ugh. I don't know what to do with myself. Sarah Angel. Let's do it. Let's go Sarah Angel, and I'm going to put his spirit link on the Sarah. There we go. Done. So hopefully I can attack next turn with my Sarah Angel. I hope. Oh man, this game. This game. I'm on eight. I'm on eight. It's my first duel in this dungeon. Oh! Oh God. Correction, I'm on seven. Let's attack with the Sarah. Yay, we gained life, finally. Now I'm gonna play Holy Light to kill that flyer. Okay, good. Um, do I wanna kill something else? Do I wanna play a moat? I mean, do I want to play a Thunder Spirit? I do. You know what? I'm just gonna... I gotta go for it. I'm... If he attacks with it, I'm just gonna block on the Sarah Angel. Fine. It's fine. The cool thing though is that I really want to win, so I'm really kind of nervous. You know, I have this feeling that like, I really want to win this. I want to get that Black Lotus. Let's attack. Okay, so I could go Swords on my own Thunder Spirit. Yeah, man, take that. Um, should I play Dancing Scimitar? I think I should, because it's a good blocker. Okay. I cannot believe, by the way, I still haven't drawn into a Disenchant. There are four in the deck! I'm gonna, I'm gonna name this Timmy and the Four Missing Disenchants. That's gonna be the, the title of this video. God, really. Um, how many cards do I have left? Am I gonna deck myself? I wouldn't be surprised. Although he's drawing more cards with his uh, Jam Day Tone. Let's just attack with whatever we have. I mean, that Spirit Link is really, really good for me. Let's count the cards. Count library cards. 34 cards in my library. Good. Whoever came up with that sound that Power Struggle makes. I mean, guys, what were they thinking at Chandelar headquarters? Uh, 
Oh man, and now again, now I gotta cancel because it's not picking it up properly. Oh God, okay. At least I'm on 16 again. Another attacker will be on 20, which is good. Another planes. Let's just attack here. Boom, there we go. Disenchant, finally! Finally killed it. Now I can play my own game. Finally. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna attack with this Hera Angel. I am go what I'm gonna do, it's quite simple. I'm gonna tank life with the Hera Angel Spirit Link until I'm really high enough back up. And then I'm going to play Wrath of God, destroy everything, cast my Sarah Angel. That's what I'm going to do. And you don't try to stop me. Let's go factory, let's attack. Let's draw a card for turn. Onulet. Okay, that's good. I want Onulet to die. Of course, counter magic. Why not? Counter magic. Counter the Onulet. Fine. Then you cannot counter the Wrath of God that I'm about to play upon you. And I think you deserve a Wrath of God. I mean, your deck is incredibly annoying. Aladdin's Ring? Oh, man. That's bad. That is, that is really bad news. I'm afraid I need another disenchant. Let's dig deeper with the gem detone. No disenchants. But at least I'm up to 28. I mean, I think he's gonna use the ring against the Sarah Angel. But maybe he's not, just maybe. I mean, this this Aladdin's ring can mean that I'm going to lose this game. I mean, I don't even know if I have to be mad about that. That's kind of cool. Oh, he's going to animate it. That's much better. Why am I not using my COP blue, by the way? I was just so focused on the... Oh no, I forgot to attack. I'm so stupid. Um, I mean, the AI is stupid, but I'm, I'm really stupid. So that's kind of an imbalance. Um, let's pass the turn. Damn, I really needed those lives. Oh, it still has the ability? Wow, I didn't know that. Oh, of course, it's Animate Artifact, not Titania Song. Oh. Okay, so I'm gonna play Wrath. It's not too bad. I can play Wrath of God, clean the table, then play out my Saras. And I can draw another an extra card with Gem to tell my end of turn. Yeah, sure, play out your creatures, that's fine. Okay, so I'm gonna play Wrath of God. Good. Then I'm gonna play at Sarah Angel. Then I'm gonna play at Sarah Angel. And then hopefully next turn I can finish this first duel.
I'm sorry for this turning out to be a really long episode, by the way. I, I, obviously, I thought I would just go in the, into the dungeon, get the Black Lotus, and go out of the dungeon, but that was a bit naive of me. I'm going to attack. I'm just going to end it here. Good. A Thunder Spirit. Okay. You know what we're going to do? Oh, another one! Oh, oh, oh no! <laughs> No, I thought I had the... Okay, I'm gonna duel you. Whatever, man. A whim. Okay, at least I can play first. And I've got the Thunder Spirit. Oh, Mox Pearl is anti? What? Oh, no. I'm actually regretting going into this dungeon, to be honest. But okay, let's attack. A meek stone. Okay, meek stone is not too bad against me. Oh, again, that stupid power struggle. Hey, disenchant. Bye bye, power struggle. Oh, thank, thank you. Thank you. Knowing that the power struggle's gone is just, it's giving me so much peace of mind. I can now just attack with the Thunder Spirit. I've got Swords to Plashers, two of those. That's all I need, really. Yeah, Yoshin, you go. You go for it, man. Yeah, I'm just going to take the ocean out because I really don't want to lose any life. Carrying ants, okay. Let's attack. Like, I can play Onulet or Argiving Archaeologist, but I really don't want to take the damage. Ooh, I think I now have to, to be honest. Let's go play out Onulet. Let's attack. I'm just gonna pass the turn. I'm fine. I'm fine with how it goes. Um, let's see, I've got two cards. So I've got three mana available basically, right? Uh, Archaeologist is three. Got no artifacts in the bin though, but it's just cool to have an Archaeologist on the table, right? Oh, no, Power Sink! Oh, God. I mean, I just feel this is one of these days where it, it, I can't complain though, because I, I still won that match and I'm, I'm still got 18 life, which is not too bad, but just all my plans are not really working out. Come on, do me a favor, kill the Onulet so I gain some life. Oh, wow. That is pretty good. Uh, we can go factory. We can. I can cast my own Sarah Angel. That's probably the best thing to do here. One, two, three, four, five. Take damage. Let's attack with the Onulet. Yay, I'm getting some life. At least I got the life back, which is something. And now if I would have had the archaeologist, so I should have kept it in hand, blah, blah, blah. But then again, he would have still had the power sink to sink the Sarah. Um, I'm going to attack. Let's see what he does. He has to block, actually. Let's play Rod of Ruin. 
One, two, three, and four. We don't want to take any damage. Oh, you do have your Mox Pearl, do you? Remember, that's my anti-card, right? That Pearl. Oh, of course. Shapeshifter. Okay, let's play Planes. Uh, I mean, I could go for Moat, then he cannot attack. I can always use the Rod of Ruin later. I could also play Sarah. I think I should go for Moat. One, two, three, four. Go for Moat. And then just pass. Remember, he's got the Royal, so I'm not going to attack with the Thunder Spirit. But now with the Moat, he cannot attack with the Shapeshifter. Ooh, whimsy, random effects. That is really bad. Simmet effects, Simmet draws, Twiddle, Ball of Suleiman. I mean, this game, you gotta love this game. This is just ridiculous. Disenchant. Whoa, okay, he's dead. What What happened? I'll. We'll have to watch it back. What happened there? Uh, I'm gonna get this dice as well because I wanna have some extra dice. Rod of Ruin, uh, that's actually quite good. I'm gonna go for that. I think Rod of Ruin is really good in this matchup. I can't complain about the dice. Uh, Disenchant in hand, okay, that's really good. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna play de Desert. Past turn, next turn I can destroy Power Struggle. Oh, is he gonna steal my Rod of Ruin? Oh, that would be bad. This, oh man, this Power Struggle. Oh God, if he's gonna keep tapping everything, I will be unable to play out my Disenchant. Oh man. <laughs> Okay, that's some, okay, now at least I can play the Disenchant. That's actually really good. Um, disenchant. I just don't, I want to do it straight away. Okay, I can go Planes. I can, okay, I can cast Holy Light so I don't take damage, but I think I'm just going to take two more. Okay, so I guess I can use Rod of Ruin on the whim. Let's go Planes, let's go Dance the Scimitar, and at least I can block one of them. Next turn, play Sarah. Oh, it comes to play tapped. <laughs> oh, this game is so annoying. Like, I'm like, why can't I not play at Sarah Angel? It's got the kiss mat, of course. Oh, man. I'm going to cast Holy Light now, by the way. So I don't take any damage from the Yoshin soldiers. I mean, that's good. Oh, this game. Let's go, Sarah Angel. Wow. That is, uh, that is disappointing. <sighs> I know I, I'm, I keep sighing a lot, but it's just, it's, it's, it's tough, you know? It's tough. I like the kiss mat royal combo by the way. It's really good. Uh got to kill I got to kill the royal. And I got to pass. I 
I mean, look at my life again. It's like slowly going down and down and down and down. You know, that's really a concern. Oh, man. Talking about concerns. Another concern hitting the board. Um, hey, I could... I think I'm going to disenchant. Play dance at St. Dark. Oh, wait. I shouldn't have done... I should have pinged the carry dance, of course. Stupid. Stupid. Uh, I gotta block it. It's gonna pump it up. Yeah, it's my own fault. I had an opening to kill the carrying ants. Why didn't I kill the carrying ants? Um, no, I'm not gonna block it with the Sarah. I'm gonna block it like this. Wow, I probably could double block it next turn, two Sarahs just to kill it. Ooh, that's good. I like that. Hey, gaining some life back. That is really good. I'm just going to double block it. I feel like I have to. Still, because I could have just played Rod of Ruin on it earlier, but I... It's water under the bridge. At least I go back up to 22. It's not too bad. Uh, let's go planes. Let's attack. I mean, my hand's empty. He still has three cards, so that's a bit of a concern, but... Could have used Rod of Ruin and Step. Forgot about it. Ooh, again, forgetting about my Rod of Ruin. Let's play Moat, so that we cannot attack with the uh, Yoshin Soldiers. We should be able to kill him next turn, hopefully. Okay. Let's do it. Hey, and let's get the treasure. Is it the Lotus? Time Twister. Wow, that is cool. Wow, that's a cool card. That is a cool card. Um, but now, what to do now? That is another question. Don't know. There are a lot of dice. Let's get a dice. There's some extra life gain. Let's get this dice. More life gain. Is there nothing here anymore? No, there's not. Um, hmm. If I defeat this dude, I have that one, right? So I might as well take the other dice as well. Because I'm actually hoping for like a good creature or something in my opener. More life. I mean, life is good as well, I guess. You know what? Mm. What to do? Shall I go to him now? Or I think I'm going to get this dice as well. Even more life. Okay, so they're only life gain dice. So I guess, I guess I'm going to battle. At least I got life. Where? Where was the shapeshifter? I did not see the shapeshifter. Oh, God. Let's check out my hand. Swords to Plowshares, Factor of Rune Planes, Disenchant, Spirit Link, Dance at Scimitar. Okay, so again, I've got a Disenchant in my opener. So let's go Factory, Bass. It's gone. Okay. I mean, I do lose a factory, but at least... Yeah, attack me with it. Of course. Why not? Horrible person. Oh, and I'm in a mana issues. Great. I got the swords, though, so if he animates, I can... Wow. 
I know, I know. He should have killed, played the swords when he when the unstable was still on the stack. But it's hard sometimes with Chandler. If you click too quickly, the window's closed. Oh wow! Look at that. No mana. No mana at all. Now we got a discard. Um. Wow, and uh, she's got a tower. She's gaining life. Another sing tower. I mean, I got a good hand. I just need mana, and I can start casting those angels. Okay, so at least that's something. Uh, let's pass. I mean, Angel Spirit Link would be super good, right? It can start gaining life. I've got Wrath of God, so if you now place out some more creatures and I can find a land, I can reset the board. Okay, let's get another planes. This is a flyer, right? So, you know what? I'm gonna cast Wrath of God. Another flyer. Rod of Ruin. Yeah, this, these matches are kind of grindy, aren't they? Okay, Holy Light. I don't have enough mana, though. I could do Holy Light, Rod of Ruin, but I don't have enough mana. Uh, let's just cast Moat. Oh, no, I'm going to drop to 21. No. I need one more mana. One more mana. I can start casting those Sarah Angels. Ooh, that's not a good one. Um, let's go Holy Death, why not? Sure, unsummon the Holy Death. I mean, you can actually do unsummon on Trike after the counters are taken off. That's kind of a, some nice synergy there, but making another choice. Okay, finally a planes. Finally. Okay, so I'm just gonna go Sarah Angel. And I am gonna block the Primal Clay, and I know that he can then shoot it down with the trike, but I really don't wanna lose more life. And I've got two more Sarahs in hand, so I can drop another Sarah, then at the right moment drop a spirit link. That is the strategy for now. Ooh, you know what I can do? I'm gonna see if that's gonna work. This is gonna be fun. I'm gonna attack. He's going to declare a double block, probably. Exactly. Now I'm going to play Holy Light. So there are one ones. Ah! Funny, funny, funny. I wonder if he's going to kill... Yeah, he's going to kill... He's going to kill the Sarah. I thought maybe he's going to let Sarah live, but he's going to kill the Sarah. But hey, I got two of his 2-2 flyers out of the game. I can just recast another Sarah. Great. I'm happy. Next turn, play Spirit Link. Start gaining some life. Although I'm a little bit scary with the Spirit Link. Probably going to play a Thunder Spirit first to see if he's got counter magic. Because if the Spirit Link will get countered, it's, it's a problem, right? Because I still have some duels to go. So let's go Thunder Spirit first. 
Okay, no response, then we go Spirit Link. Okay, no counter magic, great. And now we're in business. Oh, I can gain so much life here, that's ideal. Living the dream. Gonna gain tons of life. No, he's got another power struggle. Oh man, I didn't take into account that he too can play with power struggles. Uh, in that case, I gotta end this game as quickly as I can. Um, let's go Triskelion. Okay. Oh wait, so next turn he's going to get my Sarah. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's really bad. Okay, I'm lucky, I guess. Okay, I can disenchant again. I mean, as soon as that power struggle hits the board, I'm starting to get nervous. Um, let's go Rod of Ruin, because then I can kill my own trike, which I don't know, but I just want to, I just want my trike back. Let's attack, see what happens. Okay, um, let's play another Rod of Ruin. Let's play Onulet. I mean, Rod of Ruin is how much to activate? Oh, it's three, so I could have also chosen not to cast Onulet, but kill the Trike instead. Oh no, not on summon, I'm gonna lose the Spirit Link. Oh no, that's a good move actually. That is a good move, my man. Um, I'm gonna cast Sarah Angel, obviously. Um, that's it. I can kill my own Onulet for some life. That would be fine. Two life, it's not that much, but it's something. It's too bad though that I've lost the um mm. let's keep it. It's too bad that I've lost the um spirit link. Okay, so next turn I can kill my oh or not. I want to say I can kill him. First kill the onulet and then kill him, but uh let's go. Just first attack. Let's play. Pass turn. Oh wow. Um, let's rot of ruin. My own onulet, so I can gain two more life, and then attack and probably win the game, right? So now I've got no dice, but I've got more life. So that's pretty good, right? Uh, start to duel, power struggle. Again, I'm on the play. I can't complain about that. Uh, let's go factory, pass turn. No dizzy chance in hand though. My hand's pretty weak. I actually should have 
use the, the mana from the Mistress Factory itself to animate itself. She can do that. Um, no, I'll just play only that next turn. Or not. God for the disenchance, like for real. Okay, power struggle's gone again. Uh, remember, if I win this, oh, he's gonna attack. I'm gonna sort my own assembly work. Go onulet. I'm just gonna gonna cast more onulets. Whatever. I know I can cast a Hive and Scimitar, but... Attack! Ooh, I can deal the damage with it, gain some life. That Sam thing to do. Oh, I can no longer do it? I'm out of combat. Oh, that's stupid. Okay, whatever. Just mana burned myself. Ah. Oh. I mean, how long have we been playing? Let me check out how long we've been playing. Um, wow, we've almost been playing for two hours. This is ridiculous. Um, and this is actually a problem. The Segovian Leviathan, because I've got an island in the game. Let's attack to gain some life. Done. Hey, I'm on 34 people. I'm just gonna kind of swing in with the with the Sarah. Still gonna take me like four or five turns. Oh, that's bad. No, not another one. Okay, I got swords. That's good. Um, I mean, I do have two. Deserts. Okay, that's good. Um, no, that's not good because I can disenchant the decimal terrain, but I got an island earlier, so it's not great. Not attacking anymore? That's funny. That is very weird, my man, that you're not attacking with the Leviathan. Perhaps you're scared of my deserts, which I don't blame you. They're very scary. If you're a sea creature, you don't like the desert. I get it. I get it. It's on seven. Almost playing for two hours. I can't believe it. Deep dungeons. Ooh, Island Fish just going because I'm in trouble. Does it have trample? It does. Why doesn't this card have trample? I mean, seriously. I'm happy about it now, but I think the card should have trample. I mean, look at the casting cost of this beast, and you can only attack if your opponent has islands. At least give it island walk then. Uh, I'm just gonna attack with everything. Okay, he's on one. I can pass turn if he attacks with the. Oh, he's got damage from his own. Mana Vault. Okay. This is going to be the Black Lotus. Oh, no. Ken Labertonis. Still a good card, but no Lotus. Oh, where could the Black Lotus be? Dancing Scimitar to begin with. Ooh, a question. Which of these spells requires two black and two colors to cast? That's the Pestilence? Hey. 
I don't want to get the dice because I'm kind of happy with my scimitar. So let's find out. So I guess the last treasure has to be here, right? Let's fight the sea dragon. Mm. What do I have? Holy Light, Onulet, Plains, Rock of Ruin, Sword, COP, Blue, Sarah Angel. Oh. You know what? I'm not going to play out anything. I'm just going to discard a card. I don't care. Um, but what to discard? Let's do only that. Kill the scimitar. A creature bond. Oh, that is funny. That is funny. Um, let's play CV Blue. Let's attack with the tortoise. Oh, man, I just got to turn the volume down. This power struggle is intense. Let's attack again, put him on 13. Oh, where are my disenchants? I mean, hopefully I get his own Leviathan. That would be pretty sweet. Oh, man. What is wisdom here? Let's go dancing scimitar. Oh, wait, I got COP blue. No, <laughs> why do I enter? Why do I click enter so quickly? Why do I do that? Um, let's do Thunder Spirit. So please, Brain, try to remember I've got my COP blue. damage at least okay power struggle oh this power struggle is let's attack with the flyers play another dancing scimitar What did you do for two hours straight, or at least an hour straight? I listened to power struggle activation sound. I mean, that's... <sighs> okay, the moat, moat's quite good, I think. Cannot prevent that damage? Hmm, interesting. Oh, 
Oh yeah, let's attack. You know what? I'm going to cast Rod of Ruin because he's so low. He's on two, right? So two Rod of Ruin activations. Ooh, nice. And I got an untapped land. That is sweet. Thank you, Sea Dragon. Thank you so much. Oh, again, like if a double click, sometimes he just doesn't get it. One, two, three, and I like to target the sea dragon. Oh God, you really want to click power struggle? Finally dead, finally. Hey, there's the, oh, another dragon though. An Onulet, Onulet's good, I can sack, Onulet's good. Okay, let's do it. Oh, he gets a start though. I'm on 18. Oh, I forgot I lost so much life. It's not. Oh, yeah, of course, Black Lotus. Okay, one more game, people. I'm just gonna click as quickly as I can. You do all your swapping. I don't care. How come? Oh, wow. That works that way? Really? That works that way? I'm gonna play Holy Light. Mm, let's cast Moat. Then he can no longer attack me. I'm at least home free from that. And he gets a tapped card for me. Oh, that power struggle. Nice, he's giving me the meek stone. Um, hmm. No, I think I want to wait. Could do Dancing Scimitar, and then if he gets the Scimitar, it's still a Summoning Sickness. Yeah, let's do that. I just hope I'm gonna draw into I really hope I'm gonna draw into a um, into a disenchant. Oh power struggle. I'm tempted here to sorts my own scimitar just to deal those four damage. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to play the vultures. At least it's only one thing to exchange control over. Attack him for five, people. Yeah, take the only lead back, that's fine. So I can put you on eight next turn. But if, oh, if I get, if he steals the Sarah. Oh, I was afraid of this to happen, oh man. I can attack me. Let's get summoning sickness. 
Spirit Link. Yeah, that's good. Let's play Spirit Link on the Sarah. I'm just really hoping to get that Sarah back. I want the Sarah back. At least I had the spirit link, right? That's really good. COP blue, that's something. Pass the turn. Desert, oh god, oh man. I, is this the longest session on Chandler that we've played thus far? I'm just gonna wait until it gives me back my Sarah. I got a disenchant, but I mean, do I want a disenchant now? Maybe I do. I mean, I've got Spirit Link on there. Let's play Dancing Simulator. Jesus. Mm -hmm. What to do, what to do, what to do. Problem is if I disenchant Power Struggle, he ends up with my Sarah Angel, which I don't want because I want it back because it's got the Spirit Link. I just gotta wait. It's gotta be patient. He's gonna play a lot of creatures, so hopefully that means the chance is higher that they're gonna swap a creature for creature. Don't know if that's how it works, but if it's random, it should. Um, and then as soon as I get the Sarah back, I can cast the Disenchant. Hey, there we go. Okay, I'm happy to see that the plan worked. Now let's win this game, get that treasure, and then we've done enough for an episode, <laughs> right? I mean, geez, two hours almost. Going to the dungeon, they said. It'll be fun, they said. Hey, but I have the prize, the Lotus. That makes everything worth it, though. Let's exit ASAP. Okay. Whew. Okay, I'm going to save here. Uh, next week, I'm going to add the Lotus, maybe do another dungeon run or something. I don't know, but wow. What a session. What a session. I'm sorry for all... Uh, all the whining, but I mean, it's just, it's the power struggle, man. It's really tough. If you've ever played Chandelar against these power struggle dungeons, it's not fun all the time. But hey, I got the reward. I can't complain, so I'm super happy. Uh, thank you for uh, for staying here with me for two full hours. Let me know in the comments below if you've like watched the whole video in one go, because that's pretty impressive. Anyway, um, I'm just gonna save it again, just to make sure that it's properly saved. Right, and um, I'll see you guys uh, next time.
Oh man, two hours, crazy. What shall we do with the drunken sailor? What shall we do with the drunken sailor? What shall we do with the drunken sailor? Her light in the morning. Way day up she rises. Way day up she rises. Way day up she rises. Her light in the morning. Put him in the long boat until he's sober. Put him in the long boat until he's sober. Put him in the long boat until he's sober. Her light in the morning. Way day up she rises. Way day up she rises. Ik het is zomba gezien.